What if you have a QR code on your computer screen and you want to decode it? QR codes are perfect for phones where you have a camera to scan them. But how do you read them when they are shown on your computer screen and you don't want to use a phone camera? We can make a screen capture of the QR code and try to use a free online tool to read them. To take a screen capture, we can use the Shift Windows S shortcut on Windows, or if you are on a Mac, you can use the Command Control Shift 4 shortcut. After we select the area with the QR code and release the mouse, the selected area will be copied to the clipboard. Let's go to a free online tool to read them. I have tried a couple of free tools, but none of them allow me to paste from the clipboard. Either you can use your laptop camera or upload a file, which is quite inconvenient as I need to save the captured area. There is, however, a nice Chrome extension called QR Clip and Scan, which you can use. After installing the extension, you can open it up and click on the designated area. Once that area is selected, we can now use our paste shortcut, Command or Control V. The extension will load the image from the clipboard and show a button to open the link. Even though this works quite well, it was not suited for my needs for two reasons. The first reason being that the QR code has to be perfectly aligned. For example, if I have a rotated QR code, it will not recognize it. I'll take the screen capture and paste it in the extension. As you can see, it will not decode it. The second major disadvantage is related to Affinity. As you might know, the latest version of Affinity can create QR codes. If I directly copy the QR code from Affinity and try to paste it in the extension, it will not paste. I always need to make a screen capture. For this reason, I created my own QR reader. If you are interested in also using it, the link will be in the description. In the decode section, I can now paste my clipboard from Affinity and it will decode it successfully, which allows me to quickly check whether the QR code is correct or not. If the QR code contains a link, you can press the link text to open it up in a new tab in your browser. Let's now rotate the QR code and try my tool again. I'll make a screen capture to my clipboard, open my tool, paste it with the keyboard shortcut, and as you can see, it correctly decodes it. Pretty awesome. By the way, it also has a QR code generation built in. So if you want to generate a QR code from raw data or with different options, you could also use this tool. Not so exciting, but why not? Now you know how you can decode or read a QR code from your screen with the least amount of effort. Hope you like this tool and this video. Thanks again for tuning in. Don't forget to give a thumbs up and a sub before leaving. Until the next video.